Hey guys, what's up? This is Liberates, and today I'm going to be doing a hopefully pretty quick tutorial. It shouldn't take too long. Um, this is a tutorial on how to do ramped slow mo, and um, we're going to be doing it in Sony Vegas, which it's normally done in After Effects. So, but Sony Vegas is faster, in my opinion, and it it doesn't sound better, but it sounds similar. So, let's just get started. So, I'm going to get my clip and. Um, I'll just use uh, nope nope nope. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Okay. Okay. Um, hold on. Let me just quickly crop out the edges. I have a preset. Do it, man. You guys are just jealous. Okay. So now we have our clip of me being some kid with my AK-47. So um. So this isn't too long. I'm just gonna now I'll split it like right here and just get rid of this part, and then split it like right there and get rid of that part. So now we just got this clip of me running through smoke and raping some guy, and it's still not cropped out. Oh, it should be. Oh, interesting. All right. Okay. Now, just because I'm sorry, but I hate it that it looks like this, so I'm just gonna drag in some color correction real quick, just because I'm cool. <laughs> Okay, you're gonna wanna just a little quick like graphics tutorial. Usually add a light or medium thing to the um clip because it makes it look nice. And then I'm gonna go into properties. Oh my gosh, I can't click today. I'm sorry, guys. Hold on. Um, up first and uh, oh my gosh, I'm gonna cut my wrists. Okay, it's looking nice. All right, so now what you wanna do is you wanna go to the part that you want slow mode, and you don't wanna choose too big of a region like. I'm just gonna choose like the last four shots or five, whatever. Okay, so go to your where you want it and hit S to split it, and then go to where you want it to stop. Remember, not too long. Like mine is gonna be like 0.30 seconds. So, and then you wanna go to where you want it to stop, and you're gonna hit split. So now you're gonna drag the clip that you just this clip away, and the clip that you just cut out. Basically, you're gonna hold Control and drag it out to slow mo it and that's too much so I'm gonna drag it in a little bit less like let's let's test this shall we let's test it I wanna test it and you see it sounds really ugh, okay, I hate that noise. it's like nails on a chalkboard okay so now what you wanna do is to ramp it you're gonna come to the beginning of the clip right here to where you have that little two-way arrow thing in the box and make sure you're this clip. You're on this clip and not this clip. If you're on this clip, then the arrows will be the right arrow will be point. You know, no, that's a bad explanation. Okay, whatever. Just make sure you're on this clip. I don't think you guys are. Whatever. Okay. And then you're gonna um, zoom in a little bit and make sure you're on this clip. Click and don't hold control. Just drag it into the other clip to the clip to the left in about 0 0.05 seconds, like that. Now you want to come to the fade offset right here. And you're gonna click on it and drag it in um, to point zero ten like that. Now, if we listen, it's the same thing. So you're gonna come to the audio on the selected clip that you slow mode, and you're gonna right click, go to properties, and go to pitch change, lock to stretch. There you go. We're done. And it's pretty cool. My sister just got home, so gonna go I guess. Um I'll show this one more time at the end. Remember to request tutorials and I'll see you guys later and thank you for watching my magical stuff.